Hi, I'm Jared Spataro, and I'm part of the Modern Work team here at Microsoft. Thank you for joining us today. As much of the world shifts to a hybrid work model, it's clear that we're living through a pivotal moment that amounts to a once in a generation shift in the way we work. So naturally, as I talk to customers about the big changes ahead, I hear a lot of the same questions. How do we fundamentally rewire our organizations to embrace flexibility? How can we ensure that every employee has a seat at the table, whether they're working remotely or in the office? And in general, how can we make the future of work the best it can be for everyone? Our team has spent a lot of time thinking about these questions. And today, I'm excited to announce a new set of features within Teams and Microsoft 365 designed to level the playing field for all employees, no matter where they're working from, remote or at the office. Let's dive into a preview of today's news. The hybrid workplace will require us all to embrace flexibility in when, where, and how people work. Over the past 15 months, virtual meetings bore the weight of our need to connect and collaborate with one another in real time. But as we move into this new chapter of work, asynchronous collaboration will become an increasingly important part of how we work with others. To support asynchronous collaboration, I'm excited to announce that Fluid components are coming to Teams and Outlook, as well as Microsoft 365 applications, including Whiteboard and OneNote. Today, you'll see how Fluid components come in the form of checklists and task lists, agendas, paragraphs, and tables that stay up to date as everyone contributes their piece. We're also announcing new chat features that further support asynchronous collaboration, including the ability to reply to a specific chat message, keeping the context within the ongoing conversation. Next, we'll take a look at enhancements to Teams rooms and new meeting experiences that ensure everyone can be seen and heard and fully participate, no matter where they're joining the meeting from. Before the pandemic, being the remote person in a meeting often meant it was difficult to break into the conversation. And the camera views of people in the room might have you feeling like you were up in the corner, peering in on where the real action was happening. Right now, I'm standing in a room that represents our vision for how the meeting room should evolve. Many of the features we'll show you today have been developed on the principle that effective hybrid meetings start by designing for people who aren't in the room. We're announcing new video and content layouts in Teams rooms that give remote participants a greater sense of physical presence of the meeting room so that they can more easily be seen and heard. New devices from partners like Jabra, Logitech, Neat, and Polly provide a clearer view of those in the room to the remote participants. And the next generation of Teams experiences on Surface Hub brings more features from desktop to the meeting room. The new whiteboard and new PowerPoint Live features include laser pointer, inking, annotations, and slide translate, and help create an inclusive shared space for collaboration and contributions from everyone in the meeting, whether they're joining from the conference room or from elsewhere. And we're bringing a new set of meeting features to the Teams mobile app, making it easier to present and feel connected even when you're on the go. Our work trend index research has shown us that meeting fatigue is very real. And at this point, for me at least, sometimes the best meeting of the day is just the one I can skip entirely and still stay in the know. We're introducing fluid components in Meeting Recap, which keeps the agenda, notes, and tasks, along with the recording, transcript, and the shared meeting content all in one place, so everyone can stay organized and informed even when you don't attend. In the interest of helping people protect their time, we're also introducing Focus Mode to help you make progress on important tasks without interruption and quiet time, which helps you set boundaries around your personal time by silencing notifications during the hours you choose. And finally, a new integration from Headspace is coming this month to Microsoft Viva Insights and will be accessible in Teams, offering a curated set of guided meditations and mindfulness exercises designed to support your well-being. Hybrid work isn't just a new way to work, it's literally the rewiring of how things get done and the biggest shift in work in a generation. And I believe we have the chance to make it a win-win for everyone if we seize the opportunity, take advantage of new innovations, and embrace a growth mindset. That's how we'll create a better world of work for everyone. So thank you for tuning in. Now over to Marissa to show you these new features in action. Thanks, Jared. Hi, I'm Marissa Salazar, Microsoft Teams Senior Product Marketing Manager here at Microsoft. I'm going to spend some time walking you through our innovations that will enable everyone to stay in sync wherever and whenever they choose to work, to participate on equal footing, whether they're in the room or remote. 
and to protect their time and prioritize their health and well-being. We know the hybrid workplace will require flexibility in when, where, and how people work. While meetings will remain an important way for teams to come together, we're introducing new features that support asynchronous collaboration so everyone can stay up to date and keep work moving forward in between meetings or even instead of them. Fluid components are coming to Teams chat, allowing chat messages to be co-authored and edited in line. You can easily co-create content with your group, send a bulleted list, create a table, or share a task list. Your team can revise, add, and update content right in the chat message, knowing the latest will persist right within the message. And include other people by copying the components to other chat threads, with all edits remaining in sync, providing more transparency and alignment across teams, clear documentation, and less upfront planning. If you need to respond to an older message in a chat thread, you can reply specifically to that message by clicking Reply and having the original message quoted in your reply text box so everyone in the chat has the necessary context. You'll be able to pin a message. Chat threads can move quickly, making it hard to find important messages. With pinning, you can drive awareness and provide your chat members with quick access to critical content. This will help your team stay in sync on the key topics while staying in the context of the conversation. You can also copy and paste Fluid components to your Outlook calendar board. This free form, ever-expanding board view with an Outlook on the web lets you customize your view to keep essential items at your fingertips, enabling you to quickly see, organize, and manage your time, task lists, files, links, Fluid components, and more. And you can work confidently, knowing wherever you transfer a Fluid component, it's being synced and updated to include your team's contributions. Enabling asynchronous work allows people to collaborate whenever they need without feeling out of the loop. In the hybrid world of work, people want to know that they can work from anywhere without missing out on important conversations and decisions. Enhancements to Microsoft Teams rooms and the Teams meeting experience help ensure everyone can be seen, heard, and participate fully, no matter your location, whether that's at the office, at home, at a coffee shop, or on the go. With Microsoft Teams, remote participants are no longer at a disadvantage to those in the room. And today, we're introducing new tools for you to flexibly choose where you want to work. Now, when setting up a meeting, you can create a collaborative agenda with Fluid Components, so everyone can contribute ahead of the meeting. The agenda will be visible within the meeting experience, so everyone stays on track. Alongside the agenda, everyone in the meeting can collaborate on notes and assign tasks. These fluid components ensure meeting attendees have a clear view of what was covered and how we need to proceed forward. For a richer note-taking experience, you can open the notes in OneNote and collaborate in real time. This means there's no need for a designated note-taker assigned to a meeting anymore. And now, let's take a look at new enhancements to Microsoft Teams Rooms. Over the course of this year, we will be rolling out new experiences in Microsoft Teams Rooms, designed to ensure all meeting participants are on equal footing, so you can be seen, heard, and fully participate whether you're in the room or joining remotely. The new meeting layout in Teams Rooms makes interactions feel more natural and gives people in the room a greater sense of connection to remote participants. By moving the video gallery to the bottom of the screen, in-room participants can see their remote colleagues face-to-face. To help everyone stay more engaged, meeting content is centered on the screen, surrounded by contextual meeting information like the agenda, tasks, and notes, which, because they're fluid components, can be updated in real time. In addition, the meeting chat is now visible to everyone, providing another way for participants to share ideas and comments during the meeting. This new meeting layout will be available to all Teams rooms across both single and dual display configurations. Soon, Teams rooms with two displays will maximize screen real estate and split the video gallery across multiple displays when content isn't being shared. With more screen space, video of remote participants will be larger and can bring more attention to people who aren't in the room. We're also bringing popular features from the personal meeting experience into Teams rooms, including the ability to pin or spotlight video streams of specific remote attendees and live reactions so people in the meeting room can easily view and react to nonverbal sentiments shared by remote participants. And when using the classic video grid layout, chat bubbles alert in-room participants to conversation happening alongside the meeting, 
so nothing gets missed and all voices are heard. New devices for Teams rooms from our hardware partners help ensure more engaging and inclusive meetings for all participants, whether in the room or remote. In the past, if multiple people were in the same meeting room, transcription services wouldn't be able to differentiate between speakers. The intelligent speaker from Yealink or EPOS uses Microsoft's voice recognition technology in Teams to attribute remarks to the speaker in the meeting transcript. So remote participants can follow along with who's speaking and everyone can see a record of the conversation after the meeting. With speaker attributed meeting transcription, you can focus on contributing to the conversation instead of taking notes. It's also helpful for people who missed the meeting and need to review what was discussed. New advanced camera capabilities from our hardware partners like Neat, Logitech, Poly, and Jabra are designed to optimize the view of the room for remote participants, allowing every person in the room to be seen more clearly. We're thrilled to announce the newest partner to join the Teams device family, Neat. Neat Symmetry enables hybrid teams to see everyone in the room up close. It combines advanced AI with a high-resolution sensor to focus in and individually frame each in-room participant, following them as if they have their own camera person. With neat symmetry in Teams rooms, remote participants can feel like they're in the room without actually being there. Later this year, Teams experiences will be available across Neat's full device portfolio. Right Sight 2 for Logitech Rally Bar and Rally Bar Mini uses two cameras and active speaker tracking to automatically zoom in on the person talking while providing a second panoramic picture of the meeting room so you can continue to see everyone together. The new Poly Studio E70 is an intelligent camera that also detects who's actively speaking and zooms in for a closer view. Transitions are seamless and a future segmented view will display multiple people in their own individual frames. Jabra Panacast 50 provides an immersive 180 degree view of the room so everyone can be seen and also uses Teams' intelligent capture feature to capture the in-room whiteboard so remote participants can view it clearly. For a premium collaborative meeting experience, the new Teams Rooms on Surface Hub allows for boundaryless collaboration on a device purpose-built for Teams to meet and co-create wherever they work. The next generation of Teams experiences on Surface Hub brings more of your favorite meetings features from desktop to the meeting room, like together mode scenes, which allow for richer experiences and deeper collaboration. On Surface Hub, you can also confidently present using features like PowerPoint Live and Teams, letting you see notes, slides, and your audience all in one view. Using the new Microsoft Whiteboard experience on Surface Hub, everyone can draw and ink on the same digital canvas, no matter where they are. And as features continue to be enhanced on Whiteboard, those updates will become available to Surface Hub. Now let's take a look at the meeting enhancements for remote participants. One of the biggest challenges for remote work has been visual collaboration. In a hybrid meeting, it used to be challenging to brainstorm and solve problems together compared to ideating on a physical whiteboard in the same room. The new whiteboard experience in Teams is a virtual-first, keyboard-friendly experience that lets all meeting attendees brainstorm and visually collaborate on the same digital canvas from anywhere. And Whiteboard's integration with Microsoft Fluid Components lets you create new components like tables or bring existing content into a whiteboard to co-author. You can even copy components from Whiteboard to other places, like a Teams chat, to continue working after the meeting. To make visual collaborations easier and more structured, we have created a wide array of templates so you can start ideating faster and more effectively. In Whiteboard's expansive canvas, you can easily follow along with contributors and align on areas to collaborate. And the new Whiteboard experience will be available across all devices. After ideation and when your content is ready to share, PowerPoint Live on Teams lets you deliver the most impactful presentations from wherever you are. With a new inking experience in PowerPoint Live, you can annotate your PowerPoint as you present, and a laser pointer feature makes it even easier to visually call attention to key points. With Slide Translate, you can reach a diverse and global audience in an inclusive and engaging way. Attendees can select their native language and automatically have slides translated for them without changing the view for other attendees. Creating a positive, productive hybrid work environment is not just about bridging the gap between remote and in-room attendees. 
With Together Mode, you can meet in a consistent virtual environment that builds camaraderie while reducing meeting fatigue. And now you can create custom Together Mode scenes using Scene Studio without any coding experience. IT admins can also customize branded scenes for their organizations to create unity and familiarity. As travel returns and we're all able to get out more, Teams meetings will bring the same rich capabilities you see on desktop to mobile. With custom backgrounds, you won't have to worry about where you're joining the meeting from. Dynamic View lets the screen automatically adapt to show attendees and content. And you can confidently present with PowerPoint Live in mobile just as you would on desktop. When sharing, you'll be able to see live reactions from other attendees and share your own. As the nature of work continues to evolve, it's clear that meeting fatigue is real and protecting our time and well being is essential. We believe that everyone should feel empowered to prioritize what's important and flexibly choose how and when they want to collaborate. And while meetings will continue to be an important way for teams to come together, sometimes the best meeting is the one you didn't have to attend. To ensure people can work effectively whenever they need to, we've made the meeting recap more helpful and intuitive. As a part of the meeting recap, the agenda, notes, and tasks are automatically shared within the context of the meeting, along with the recording, transcript, and the shared content. If you join a meeting after it starts, or if you're examining content after the meeting's over, it's now easy to catch up on the agenda, view the synthesized notes, and full transcription with everything in one place. And because the notes, tasks, and action items are fluid components, you can continue to collaborate and update your work in the app you choose across Teams, Outlook for the Web, or OneNote. Now, whether you are in the meeting or not, you can stay in the know, focus on what's important, and collaborate effectively, allowing you to reclaim your time from back-to-back -back meetings. We're also introducing new personal well-being experiences as a part of Microsoft Viva, our employee experience platform to empower people to stay productive while providing opportunities to disconnect and recharge. To decrease stress from back-to-back -back meetings and help people focus, we're bringing a curated set of guided meditations and mindfulness exercises from Headspace into the Viva Insights app in Teams. Hi, and welcome to Headspace on listening to others. These exercises will help you start your day grounded, relax your mind before a big presentation, or disconnect from work in the evening. Back-to-back -back meetings also lead to a rise in after-hours work to finish your tasks. Viva Insights now enables you to schedule daily focus time to work uninterrupted. Later this year, we will introduce a new focus mode in the Viva Insights app, featuring focus music from Headspace and the ability to make progress on important tasks in 25-minute intervals with regularly scheduled breaks. To protect your personal time, later this year, Viva Insights will offer the ability to set quiet time to silence after-hours mobile notifications from Teams and Outlook. You'll also receive personalized insights on how many days you successfully had without meetings, emails, and chats outside of your working hours. And with new controls in Microsoft Endpoint Manager, IT administrators can also create org-level policies to mute after-hours notifications. With Teams asynchronous tools and Viva Insights, hold fewer meetings, balance productivity and well being, and create better boundaries between work and life. Hybrid work represents the biggest shift to how we work in our generation. And I believe that we have the opportunity to create a new world of work that can be better for everyone. When business leaders listen to their employees and what they want, and make thoughtful, conscious decisions about how they move forward and embrace flexibility, then we can pull forward the best of both worlds, in office and remote. Thank you so much for tuning in. We know it's a busy season, and we sincerely appreciate you making the time.